Good afternoon, everyone. This is Cindy from My Altered Muse. Um, I have a little project I would like to show, show you this afternoon. And also, I would like to remind you that my Etsy shop is also My Altered Muse. And the link to my shop is in the description box below. Okay, I have made this beautiful journal... Um, not journal, um, embellishment needle book. I started out with just this pretty little lace book. And, um, let me give you the dimensions. I don't think my ruler's in here, so let me use this. Um, it measures, um, six inches across. And she is seven inches long. And um, everything in this book is removable and intended for you to use in your projects. Um, I just made her yesterday and I just sat there and just pulled from all my stash and just kept kept on until I got her nice and full. I kept the front kind of simple. Um, let me show you. Um, it's just lace, and I'll show you the back. And um, this is what it looks like. And I just added this pretty sorry silk ribbon, and I added this um, aqua stick pen. The color um, palette in this is um, aqua cream and a touch of blue. So, um, yeah, I think it just turned out beautiful. I had so much fun making it. It was, um, it was uh, quite different than working with paper and making my journals, but um, I have a lot of ephemera, and I just thought I'd make this pretty little book. Okay, so let's open her up. And um, I will talk you through it. Like I say, everything in this book is removable. It's just hand-stitched in. And um, we'll start out with this. Um, I made this um, gathered um, side um, piece for your um, journal or whatever you want to use it for. This is a beautiful piece of quilting material that I had. And so I gathered it up, and it's just attached to this piece of um, satin ribbon with stitching. And the satin ribbon is just attached um, with some stitches. And um, this... Um, is, this can also be removed. Um, I just stitched it on the bottom. You can leave it there, the applique. You can leave it where it is, or you can take it off and use it separately. Okay. Um, the second page is... Um, this is so pretty. The second page... I did um, lace... And I did this uh, beautiful uh, trim with a gold fiber running through it. And I added the little aqua roses up here. And this is actually a flat back button. You would glue it on whatever you would use it with. It doesn't have a, a stitch area. And then I added this sweet little, um, little dangle here. It's... Um, glass beads and um yeah and um like i say everything on here is just removable with a snip of a pair of scissors okay then we're going to turn it over and um this page i added a little bit of deaf delf blue in to go with the aqua um and all you have to do is snip this, and we have, let me put something behind this to prop it up. There we go. Well, um, on this, all this is just stitched together, and you have a piece of um, 
yardstick um, ribbon. Well, first of all, you have the blue button, then you have the ribbon, then this is a, um, a cluster that I handmade, hand stitched, and it's just stitched down. And then we have a piece, of, this is actually um, vintage uh, eyelet embroidery. And then next is, this is probably about six to eight, six, about six to eight inches of um, a real Delph, Delph, Delph blue gathered. Um, it's, <coughs> excuse me, it's real pretty. And then next I added a real pretty piece of um, quilting material. And it's, it's over six inches long. It's doubled. Okay, and if you take everything out, if you snip everything out, you're going to have a beautiful needle book because all of this is um, a felted wool, wool felted, and I have put, um, I have put eyelet embroidery across the bottom. You can take it off and use it or you can leave it, leave it and use this as a needle book. Okay, the neck, let me make sure I'm in frame. I'm always afraid I'm not. Let me move down just a little bit. Okay. Now, the next page, um, I went with, um, I added some really pretty, uh, these are black um, little tiny safety pins. And then this is some aqua trim. And then this is some bling. All of this can be taken off and just uh, take your scissors and snip this off, snip this off, and you've got all this to use. Then over here, I added needles, and this is the back of your little black pins. This is the center, and this is just hand-stitched in. This blue satin and silk uh, flower is hand stitched in and then you've got the pretty little gold um, tiny petite um, um, <clears throat> safety pins and then I ran the um, eyelet down this side too okay then we're gonna turn over this page I put a piece of this is um, a piece from um, Sheila Gingrich's beautiful trims that she sells I had a piece of that so I added it this is a stick pin that I added it's pearls and it's got a glittered um, piece in it and then a little tiny um, little silk flower and then more um, eyelet embroidery here. And then on this felted wool page, we have more of the little aqua flowers that can be snipped off. And um, this is um, an aqua dangle, just beautiful. This is from Sheila. And then this um, dangle I made myself is from Pearls and Glass Beads. And then this dangle is also from Sheila. These are just beautiful. Let me get closer so you can see all the detail on those. See the little tiny beads on the... Just This is just, just exquisite. Just beautiful. Okay, then we're going to turn over again. And on this page, um, I have a piece of the Sorry Silk that has the um, the applique on it and the glitters. And I forgot to measure it, but it's a nice piece. I'd say it's um, probably five by five or larger. And um, you can, here again, um, you can just um, snip these buttons off. The buttons are holding it along with the um, the um, velvet lay, a uh, velvet um, trim. So all that's to be used. And then this is the last page, and I added um, another dangle. 
and you you will acquire several um, bulb pens with this kit also. And then here is um, a pretty piece of dyed um, material, aqua. And then here's a piece of lace. I actually doubled it over. It's like that. And then another pretty piece of um, this um, satiny material from Sheila. And then this is also from Sheila too. And then here is um, a little button. This is how I sewed this into the book. So all you would do is just snip the button and it, this would come out. And then last but not least, I made a tag. And it's um, all little swatches of um, material that um, it's all uh, quilt fabric and a sweet little applique and a sweet, look at that sweet little flower button. I just love that. It's got detail on it. And then I added another piece of sorry silk. And then it closes over in the back. It's just beautiful. It's some um, lace kind of gathered and just beautiful. This would be a lovely piece um, to just lay in your sewing room if you didn't want to um, use the pieces. Or you could use the pieces in here and then use it for a needle book. Um, you could put embroidery in here, um, all kind of fun things. So anyway, um, I just wanted to share this with you, and um, I hope you're doing good today. And like I say, this is in my Etsy shop, and as soon as I get this uploaded, um, I will um, post it. So um, I want to thank everyone, and... Um, I will talk to you soon. Okay, bye-bye.